Today we'll be doing a quick run through of the different types of ball valve and what situations they're suitable for. So the mechanism that gives ball valves their name is a hollow sphere located in the centre of the valve that, when turned, either denies the passage of liquid or lets it flow through the sphere's hollowed core. The main benefit of this design is that when the passage is completely open, it runs at full bore, meaning that there's little to no head loss and that it's very difficult for debris to get lodged or caught on anything and lead to blockage. The downside to this design is that it's not effective at fine control and is much more suited to being either fully open or fully closed. To try and use a ball valve for flow modulation can cause its mechanism to erode over time due to the velocity and pressure of the flow, which in turn can lead to leakage. For fine control and flow modulation, globe valves are a much more suitable choice. Now ball valves can be categorised by a number of factors, but the main thing to pay attention to is what end things they have and what purpose they'll serve in your pipe system. For example, a large portion of ball valves are connected via BSP threading, which are more awkward to repeatedly disconnect for maintenance than say a valve using a compression fitting. Another option is to use a valve with a union end, preferably a double union as it allows you to remove the valve entirely with ease whereas single unions are designed to be at the end of a system where one end would be permanently joined to the pipe. You can also get ball valves with multiple inlets which allow you to switch between different combinations of flows. For example, with three inlets, they can be configured to have either an L port that allows you to switch between using pairs or a T port that gives you the option to have all three connected at once. That's roughly all you need to know about ball valves. Should you need any more information or have any questions, please get in contact with us at the number below or go to our website where we have a huge selection of ball valves and much, much more. The links are in the description.